Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you a new and exciting new extension that we're building. It's in beta and we're working with our uh, beta customers to refine it, but we still want to show you what it can do. This is an advanced search extension for Magento and unlike some other extensions, it doesn't require like a third party uh, search indexer or something or like a search engine that that's going to be separated from your Magento like Sphinx or Solar. Uh, this one just builds on top of internal capabilities of PHP and MySQL and just deliver a little bit extra functionality. So our beta, pro, our beta extension what it has right now it has the auto suggest and auto correction uh, built in and it bases it based on your uh, catalog uh, product information. So once you install it, you will see an advanced search tab under your catalog. And this might change in the future, but for now, this is how it works. Uh, and then under here, you, it gives you a little bit of statistics. Uh, and basically, what you need to do is build the dictionary. Uh, once the dictionary is built, essentially we have a, a very small but uh, unique um, index based on our own inventory that can allow us to improve the search results. Uh, now, Before I continue to the actual search results, I want to show you that we do have some configuration options available right now and those are uh, maximum corrections. We don't have a we don't want to show like an endless list of seven or ten corrections. We we allow you to change that, but you'll see exactly what I'm talking about pretty soon. And then stop words, words that we don't want to associate with correct corrections. So we don't want to use them as a as a suggestive word for our customers. Um, so this is a sample data from. It's actually a partial data of one of our customers. Uh, it doesn't matter which one, but all that matters, we have over 2,000 products here. Um, and then our index just built uh, a dictionary based on this specific product um, catalog. And I'm going to show you how this works with a few uh, typos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually search for it. I'm going to enter typos and you're going to see what it does. So you can see that one of our products here, it's, it's called Tunit. Uh, I don't know exactly what it means, but I'm gonna just bank on that. So if I type it with a typo, Tunit, you'll notice that this is our extension, this is what it does. So basically it, it asks us, okay, did you mean Tunit? Uh, because it knows that there is no Tunat, and it also knows that we do have Tunit, so it, it, it associates the two. So then, um, I if you actually click on this, it will do a search on Tunit, and then will give us the corrected result. So let's go and check a few more. So I see here there is a field sock something. So I'm gonna type it with a typo again. And now we get three results because that's the maximum that we requested or that we set for it. And the first one is actually the correct one of what we're looking at here, because this is the closest word. And then there is also felt and flat. Uh, but this is just giving you some sort of an idea of what this extension does. It's the auto suggest, auto correction built into your catalog without anything else. So here's another word that um, I, I just switched to page three, where you can see those products. So it pulls the information from here and then shows it to you. Probably there's another product with the word formation. And then I typed uh, an error, so for motion. Uh, and then it also smartly uh, elaborates with the original search from Magento. So you can see it if I type SHO. So you can see these are the three suggestions. And then these are the original ones. So if you if you do a search in Magento, it actually records that keyword and then it records also how many results we got. So this is the original functionality of Magento and this is the added functionality of this extension. So it works hand in hand and doesn't overwrite completely. 
So we're curious to know what you think about this and uh, let us know in the comments. Uh, let us know if uh, you're uh, interested in participating in our beta uh, customer. We only have a few more spots left. Uh, a few more spots left and uh, yeah, let us know.